In this video, we share with you the Creating Comfort in Choice theory. It describes how women decide whether or not to take antidepressant medication during pregnancy. Women who faced this choice created this theory to help other women who are trying to make this same choice. In the center is a woman who has experienced depression. She is pregnant or planning a pregnancy. She is thinking about whether to take antidepressants during pregnancy. She might be thinking about this choice at any time before or during pregnancy. She lives in a society that expects women to sacrifice themselves for their children and that limits the choices women can make for themselves. This society doesn't provide equal access to healthcare, like therapy, for all women. It also judges harshly the experience of depression and the use of antidepressants, especially in pregnancy. Because of all this, she feels anxiety, guilt, and fear. As she thinks about whether to take antidepressants in pregnancy, she seeks information, she tries to make sense of this information, and she tries to soothe herself. She moves back and forth between doing these three things. In seeking information, she tries to understand what the risk of harm is to herself and to her baby. She thinks about her own experiences, for example, if she's taken antidepressants before. She talks about the options with her family, friends, or healthcare professionals. She looks for written information online or from her doctor. In making sense of information, she thinks about whether she can trust the information she has. She thinks about her own beliefs. She imagines what might happen if she chooses one option or another option. She tries to see the information from different angles. She tries to put all the information together to figure out what risks of harm there are with different choices. In self-soothing, she tries to manage her anxiety, guilt, and fear to try to get comfortable in the process or with a possible choice. She might repeat a mantra to herself like, I'm doing the best I can. She might reassure herself that she's not alone in trying to make this choice. She might block out scary news or unhelpful advice from others. She might work on a plan to protect her mental health. As she gets closer to choosing, she tries to connect the information she has gathered with her beliefs and preferences. She tries to resolve any conflict that she's come across. For example, if she would prefer not to take antidepressants, but her doctor thinks she should, she might seek more information, perhaps by talking to friends or family. She tries to see what's most important to her. She tries to feel comfortable with the choice she's reaching towards. If she does make a choice, she might come back to it later and either confirm the same choice or reach a different choice. Making these choices is hard. If you are trying to make this choice, resources include the BC Reproductive Mental Health Program, the Pacific Postpartum Support Society, and the ADAPT Clinic. Check out the links below.